Carbon 6, that is a new high-tech manufacturing company in Rexburg that takes scraps of carbon fiber and then makes them into polished wedding rings. Eyewitness News reporter Chris Nesman visited Carbon 6 today. Chris uh, is here with us now. How many other companies do something like this? You know, Todd, not very many. In fact, Carbon 6 showed me a little bit of what they call the forged carbon process. It was first invented by Lamborghini and less than a dozen companies around the world use it. Take a look. In a backyard shed on the west side of Rexburg, a small company is taking flimsy carbon fiber leftovers and turning them into beautiful polished rings. Uh, because of the way that the forged carbon fiber is processed, the way that we process it and other companies, not very many other companies process it, it allows you to make things that are solid, strong, and, uh, and three-dimensional, true three-dimensional. The process itself is simple, but it takes time, steps, and the manpower to do it. First part is creating the molds and the machines to do it. My job here at Carbon 6 is to um, design and produce all of the tooling and all of the machinery that we use in production. Once the mold is made, it's coated and protected, and then the loose pieces of carbon fiber are smashed into the rod-shaped molds. If, if we don't get it packed well enough, then we basically end up with a bad rod that we have to get rid of because we can't reuse the carbon fiber after it's been cooked. Then, it's heating time. I make sure they're pressed, the rods are pulled, stick them in the oven to cook them, and then once they're in the oven, we go pull them out. After that, the rods are split apart, refined, and prepped. We're just prepping the logs when they come over from the other station, filing it. Uh, we cut it into rings of five. Um, we bore out the center. We true it, make sure that it's nice and neat. And then we send it over to cut them and part them into individual rings. And then we send it off to polish. The polish rings look completely different from what they started as, with some of them even glowing in the dark. All of it started in one backyard shed in Rexburg. That's pretty cool. Now, obviously, Carbon 6 didn't show me everything in their processes as they, like any other company, do have their trade secrets. So, you know, most of it, just not all. Reporting in studio, I'm Chris Nestman. They're entitled to that, you bet. Yeah. yeah. But the glow in the dark kind of stuff, that'd be, that'd be kind of neat. I like yeah. it. Thanks, Chris. If you are interested, we have a link to Carbon 6's website on our website. Just go to kidk.com.